When you think about the Easter candy Cadbury cream eggs, you probably don't think about sex. At least we hope you don't. The creamy chocolate candy is an Easter basket staple that until now has been totally unsexualized. But this year, Cadbury released a commercial that has sparked a lot of controversy and a lot of sex talk. This commercial has been described as disgusting, graphic, and lewd. There's even a petition to take it off the air, and it has over 25,000 signatures. Some viewers have even said the commercial directly taunts Christians. The 50th anniversary commercial for Cadbury cream eggs may seem innocent, but it has a lot of people up in arms. Keep watching to find out what Cadbury has done to cause this much controversy. Now, before we dive into all the backlash, let's talk about the commercial itself. This way you can decide for yourself. We'll be honest, we think people are kinda overreacting. But nevertheless, here we go. Based on the backlash, you may think this commercial depicts hate crimes or features a line of Playboy bunnies proactively licking their chocolate eggs, but the real story is a little more bizarre. The Cadbury egg commercial in question was released in early February 2021 to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the candy. It starts as any commercial would, with bright colors and a clear shot of the iconic cream-filled candy. The narrator announces that 2021 is the year of the Cadbury egg golden goobily. The commercial depicts people licking their Cadbury eggs, dipping their fingers into the cream, cracking them into a confection. They show some pretty creative ways to eat a Cadbury egg. People smile at the camera, bite into their eggs joyously. The narrator makes a couple of jokes and plenty of egg puns. All in all, it's a pretty standard commercial. There's no wrong way to eat a Cadbury egg, the narrator argues, because what matters is you're enjoying it. Whether you're a licker, a dipper, a biter, a baker, a candlestick maker, Cadbury supports you. If you have a weak stomach or hate puns, you may feel a little weird about the close-up shots of people licking a cream egg. But that's not what the controversy is about. The controversy is over what the narrator describes as sharers. What has so many people up in arms is the final shot. Two men, a couple, are holding hands and spinning on a rooftop while jubilant music plays. The actors are a real-life couple, and you can see the chemistry between them. One man holds an iconic Cadbury cream egg in his mouth, the other leans in to bite the egg and half. You see the cream ooze out between their mouths as they smile and almost kiss. The music swells, the men eat their shared Cadbury cream egg, they finish spinning around. Then the shot's over and the commercial ends. If you're worried it was made without social distancing, don't be. The actors live and work together, and the commercial was made following strict pandemic guidelines. So what's the big deal? The commercial sounds cheesy, sure, but nothing to get offended over, right? Well, according to over 20,000 people, it's highly offensive, unforgivable even. Some people get really, really mad when they see gay people on their TV. That's what's at the crux of this controversy, the gay men sharing a Cadbury egg hands-free. Some viewers are saying the image of Cadbury cream between the men's mouths is, quote, highly sexualized and inappropriate for children. People were tweeting, fleeting, and TikToking their outrage over this commercial. To hear them tell it, Cadbury may as well have been broadcasting X-rated pornography to sell their candy eggs. Sound like an overreaction? That's because it is. Mere days after the commercial aired, a petition was launched anonymously on Citizen Go, urging the commercial be banned from the airwaves. Here's what the anonymous petitioner has to say about the cream-laden kiss. By choosing to feature a same-sex couple, Cadbury's are clearly hoping to cause controversy and escape criticism by claiming that any objections must be rooted in homophobia. But members of the LGBT community have also expressed their dislike of the campaign. Cadbury's are well aware of the religious significance of Easter. Therefore, they are trying to cause gratuitous offense to members of the Christian community during the most important feast in their calendar. For those of all faiths and none, the Cadbury's cream egg has become a synonymous part of Easter celebrations in the United Kingdom. Cadbury's knows full well their product is enjoyed by children and deliberately marketed at this demographic, making this campaign even more irresponsible. It's traditionally a brand associated with families. Exposing children to sexualized content constitutes a form of grooming. It's well known that children will often copy what they see on screen. This guy genuinely thinks that seeing two gay men eat a candy egg in a commercial is grooming and an attack on Christianity. They are seriously convinced that Cadbury is attacking the holiday of Easter through this commercial. But most rational people would think that's a pretty big leap. The thing is, the petition has over 26,000 signatures, and people are still signing it. A simple search for Cadbury Egg Commercial on Twitter will show you thousands of tweets where people insist the Cadbury Egg Commercial is, and I quote, selling sex to children. 
People are actually boycotting Cadbury over the commercial. They were so turned off by the image of two men sharing a chocolate egg, they're denying themselves their favorite candy. In response, the official Cadbury Twitter account has been responding, We've always been a progressive brand that spreads a message of inclusion, whether it's through products or campaigns. The almost kiss of a couple sharing a cream egg was included in the ad in the same light any other couple would have been included too. The heart of cream egg is fun, lighthearted, and we believe the almost kiss conveys this. Cadbury stands strong in their choice to feature a gay couple in their commercial. They promote inclusion and don't even entertain the idea that the commercial is inappropriate for children. They're basically telling all the offended people to get their minds out of the gutter. Despite this, people are still mad. They can't get over the capital offense of seeing a gay couple share some chocolate and cream. Professional American outrage group One Million Moms has even chimed in. They're taking on this commercial as one of their official issues of 2021. They're repeating the same general idea as the anonymous petitioner, that it's disgusting and it's sexualized. It's important to note, though, that One Million Moms has a long history of getting offended over LGBT content. In 2020 alone, they railed against a Burger King commercial where someone said damn, the Shakira and J-Lo halftime show, a DuckTales character with gay dads, and a Hallmark movie featuring featuring a gay couple. One Million Moms has a long history of raging against LGBT representation in any sort of media, so we're pretty loath to take anything they say seriously. And in a typical internet move, the backlash has also sparked some counter-backlash. People are mercilessly making fun of the offended parties online, calling them homophobic, weak, and thin-skinned. If you're a little surprised at the controversy over a short commercial, don't worry, we are too. Who would have thought that people in 2021 would still react to LGBT people with such vitriol? So what do you think? Are people overreacting to the gay candy commercial? Or was that cream-laden kiss highly inappropriate and traumatizing? Let us know what you think in the comments section below. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and subscribe to our channel. And click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.